All right, here we have this 12-inch Zero box fan. I've been meaning to do a video on it for a few days now. Um, there was a video I made on it, but it was just kind of a cold start video. Um, but I never actually made a full in-depth video on it. Uh, this I got this from Nick Dixon. Um, I don't remember how I ended up with it. I think it was a trade deal or something. Either way, I ended up with it. Um, I kind of like it. It's a neat little thing. I've never seen these exact McGraw Edison blades blades before. They're kind of cool looking. It's not in the greatest shape. I mean, it's got some rust, but I mean, it's not the worst either. It could be a lot worse than it really is. It is a three speed. And the reason I like it is because it's a zero. I always see the Eskimo branded ones or whatever, but I hardly ever see the zero branded ones. At least the box fans, like the little desk fans, I see those under the zero name all the time, but never the box fans. Apparently, it runs 0.9 amps, 115 volts. It's a model 12499. 60 cycles, AC only. McGraw Edison Company, Bursted Manufacturing Division, Boonville, Missouri. Um, I had an Eskimo version of this. I gave Nick that one. And I got this one. So, I guess that's kind of what happened. I got rid of the Eskimo version and got a Zero version. Which the Zero version is pretty cool. I kind of like it. It's pretty much identical to the other fan, though. In pretty much every way possible. The only real difference is the badge. And the handle's a little different. It has these middle pieces there. It has the original knob still, so... That's nice. But anyway, we'll start it up on high. And yeah... Now this fan runs off a speed coil, unlike most, you know, modern fans, or modern-ish, that have, you know, different speed windings in the motor. This runs off a coil that has a single speed motor. So the coil alternates the speed on the fan, essentially. Running pretty nice though. It's really quiet. Do the medium. I think that's medium. It's not very fast on medium. I said, I think the motor is still warm enough, so, you know, and low, very quiet on low, but it's still cold, and it probably needs oiled, I haven't really messed with it hardly, since I got it, it's high again, Pretty neat little fan. I'll probably do some work to it. Probably oil it and everything and go from there. Although it doesn't seem like it really needs oil, but you never know. Sometimes things are just weird like that. Seems like it has good bearings, though. So, yeah, there's a little 12-inch Zero fan from... I want to say early 60s, late 50s, probably early 60s. Uh, so thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed.